Luka Modric's journey to the World Cup final is the most inspirational story ever. At the age of six, Luka Modric's life was rocked to the core. He was made a refugee after his grandfather was shot dead by ethnic Serb rebels close to his home. It was a moment that would live with him forever. In the coming years he would live in a war zone and grew up to the sound of grenades exploding as conflict went on and on. He eventually fled Croatia after his house was burned down but despite the troubles in his life, football was a means of escapism for Modric. He eventually moved into a hotel in the coastal town of Zadar, a place where war was still ongoing. That didn't stop him from perusing his dream, though. A spokesman for the Colover Hotel, where Modric lived as a youngster, once said via the Daily Mail, he had broken more glass on the hotel windows than what the bombs had hit. He was playing non-stop football all around the hotel halls. Football also had its obstacles. Coaches said he was too weak and too shy to play football but as we all know, his career fledged into something rather special. On Wednesday July 12, the people who doubted him as a kid watched Luka Modric lead Croatia to their first ever World Cup final. Modric once again pulled the strings in midfield to help his side progress in the World Cup. It's clear that he is a class above the rest, he creates space for himself like no other. His passing is second to none. And his journey to the final is just another chapter in a remarkable life. Take a bow, Luca.